Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on what time it is, where you're at, as you're looking at this. I'm very happy and joyful that you have chosen to watch this video. The purpose of this video is to give you a new insight into God's purpose for your life. Uh, we're going to call this, Consider the Concerns of Your Heart as you inquire of God each day. The concerns of your heart as you inquire of God. In many ways, I am inviting you to do just a little more. In many ways, I am simultaneously inviting you to do just a little less. I speak to your heart in a context that is, in a context, excuse me, that is relative. For some of you are motivated by the fears that haunt you. And so you work and strive and make yourself busy. And for others, you are so busy dreaming and theorizing that you need to put things into practice and overcome your fears and take action. Different people, at different seasons, for different reasons, are invited to meet the Lord in the quiet, still place and engage with Him there. To engage with the Lord. Even in the midst of your busyness and activity, you will find me there, with you, in you sharing and guiding, and in the midst of the peace afforded to you, so also you will find me there with you and in you, sharing and guiding. So, take inventory this moment and listen to what I am saying to you this day. For yesterday is done and over. Tomorrow may never come. Reflect on what I have for you this day and consider what I am saying and asking of you. Am I asking you to be still? Then sit with me in the quiet of your heart, in the quiet of your mind, and allow me to calm the storm raging in your circumstances and your relationships. Let me bring you some peace and some stability of abiding with the Lord and allow him to guide you, to provide for you, to heal you, and to protect you. Allow him to do the heavy lifting on your behalf, for his yoke is easy and his burden is light. Am I asking you then to be active? Then work hard with all of your passion, all of your strength and capacity without holding back. Do not allow excuses or fears to rule your heart, but walk by faith, knowing I know what you have need of before you ever ask. Walk by faith then, for the Lord will supply you with what you need. Walk by faith, for the Lord will bring you to these, cha to these challenges, but he will also bring you through these challenges and will do so with elegance, with excellence, much kindness, and compassion. Listen to me this day and every day, and consider what I am saying. Consider this day and this hour, and the issues and concerns of your heart. Consider what is before you, and inquire of the Lord each day afresh and anew. Hope this little bit of spiritual coaching helps somebody. It is my sincere hope that we that I have been able to do that by recording this reading this afternoon. I want to thank each and every one of you for your time. If you like you can subscribe to my newsletter at pburn.substack.com 
.com. That's v b e r n .substack .com. And it will be delivered twice a week to your inbox. One for the Bible studies, which are very contemporary, and one for the um, weekly messages, which are equally contemporary. Breaking new ground, harvesting new souls for Jesus Christ. And so that's all we have for today. May you be blessed in Jesus' mighty name.